What's up, everybody? Welcome back to our channel, guys. So, we have a little challenge on our hands. Today, we are going to be doing the spelling bee challenge. Not only do we have to spell the words, but we have to use them in a sentence. But, to make things interesting, We've already been sipping. We've taken a couple shots. So. We like competition and we like fun. So I hope you guys are ready. Alright, my first year first. I'll go first. Okay. Diphthong. <laughs> I swear to you, it's a word. Diphthong. I believe you. Okay, now I'm gonna spell it, obviously. Alright. No. Yeah, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Okay. D I P. I feel like there's an extra P in there. <laughs> D I P. I'm throwing an extra P just because. <laughs> this is too easy. Okay, spell it. Spell it. <laughs> okay, no. okay, there's one P. D I P. T H. O N G. Eh. <laughs> You are wrong. <laughs> Throw it in a sentence. Just make something up. I'm gonna put my dip thong on and go swimming. <laughs> no. So dip thong. Dip thong is spelled D I P H T H O N G, and it is when two vowel sounds are combined to make one vowel. Yes. You know how they put like the A and the E, and it looks like they're meshed together. Your first word is logaria. Logaria? Logaria. 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 Oh man. Hmm. Okay, okay. My gut is telling me one thing, but I'm thinking I'm gonna go with my gut. L A G A R I A. What? Logaria. L A G What's this one? L O G. A R E A. No. You say like I know what this word is. I didn't know this word is. <laughs> okay. Is okay. It okay. Sentence? I hooked up with some chick last night. I think I got logaria. <laughs> oh my god. How do you spell it? What does it mean? L O G O R R H E A. Oh my. And it's excessive and incoherent talking. Essentially, it's what you do when you're intoxicated. It's nollygoster. <laughs> Snollygoster. Snollygoster. S S N O L L Y I Snolly S N O L L I G H O S T E R. You spelled like Snolly Ghoster. No. You said G H. I don't know. There's like a silent letter in there somewhere. S N O G. Wait. S N O L L I Y. Damn it! What did I say the first time? She's done. She's done. I'm spelling it for you. Snolly Ghoster. I spelled that word wrong. You spelled it wrong. S N O L L Y G O S T E R. You put spell Snolly Ghoster. You put an I it's with a Y. It's spelled Snolly Ghoster. Is it a sentence? I did. It says Snolly Ghoster. I spelled Snolly Ghoster. I spelled that word wrong. That's a boring sentence. What the hell? <laughs> All right. It means to do or say things for personal advancement. Your word is hobbledehoy. <laughs> Hob oh my. Hobbledehoy. 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 <laughs> Okay, hop. Say it again. Hop. Hobbledy hoy. Hobbledy hoy. Um, H O B L E D E H O Y. Hobble, right? Hobbledy hoy. Sounds like something. Hobbledy hoy. Doodle Bob would say. Ni o yo ni no i baby on no mai. Hobbledy hoy. H O B L E D E H O Y E. Come on. No. Is that close? That's close. 
Yes, it's close. It's close, isn't it? Mm -hmm. okay. Very spelled twice. Usually in a sentence. I'm gonna hobbly hoy my way down here to get some food. You're close, you're close. You missed a B and there's no E at the end. Oh, there's two Bs. H-O-B-B-L-E-D-E-H-O-Y. And it is an awkward, bad-mannered, adolescent boy. <laughs> no, that was me growing up. <laughs> Cockamamie. <laughs> Cockamamie. Was it like... Okay. It's one word, there's no hyphen. I know. Is it like, caca? Mommy? Caca? Mommy? It... Sound it out. Okay, Sound is it caca? Mommy? Or caca? Mommy? <laughs> <laughs> it's not caca? Mommy. <laughs> it's whatever you said before that one. <laughs> caca? Mommy? Yep. Uh, C O C K. Oh, this is getting harder the more I dream. It's hard C to spell Kagamami. C O C K A A M A M I <laughs> Kagamami. Oh my gosh, you were so close. One letter off. There's an E at the end. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna take you home tonight and give you this cockamamie. <laughs> oh man, that is wrong. Cockamamie <laughs> is spelled C O C A. I, I I was about to say as you were. Oh my gosh. C O C K A M A M I E, and it means Damn it. and it means implausible. I wish there are people watching this right now like them. These people are stupid. Alright, hit me. I'm gonna get one more. Your word is surreptitious. Surreptitious. You can't even say it like this. How is that fair? How is this fair? I don't know, and everyone how to say it too. Say it again. Sur- sur- Oh my gosh. She can't even say it right. This is not fair. Surreptitious. Surreptitious? Surreptitious. 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 I'm lost. She's saying like four different words. Get ya. Yeah, look, I'll play it. I'll play it. Yeah, let me hear it. Surreptitious. Surreptitious. I've <laughs> been saying it for like four minutes. Surreptitious. Surreptitious. <laughs> Surreptitious. Sur syrup stitches. That's what I just said. Syrup stitches. Syrup Surreptitious. Surreptitious. S I R E P T I Surreptitious. T I T O U S. Close. How do you spell it? Oh, okay. Surreptitious. Yeah. Why are you talking like that? You sound surreptitious. Yeah, I got it right. Yeah. I got it right? That is. But you didn't spell it right. I don't care, but I got part of it right. Okay. It's marked by quiet, caution, and secrecy. Yes! So I guess that would be yeah. a correct sentence. That would. Wittershins. Wittershins? Wittershins. Is it Wittershins? No, there's no H in there. I'm not Stewie. Wait, what? I said you ought to be nicer to Will Wheaton. You mean Will Wheaton? Yes, Will Wheaton. W-I-T-T-E-R-S-H. I-N-S. Oh, you were close. That's why I finalized nope. it. It's wrong. Where shins? Replace the two T's with two D's. So it's not witter shins, it's witter shins. I said witter shins. You said witter shins. No, I did not. I said, we got it on camera. We're going to view it tomorrow and be like, damn, he did say witter shins. <laughs> witter shins. What, what does it mean? Bring me my witter shins. It's freezing outside. <laughs> no. Hell no. It means... The contrary direction. So like counterclockwise. That's what it means. Okay, so then you use it in a sentence. Um You don't even know. Bum fuzzle. Bun? Bum fuzzle. Bum, bum funnel. Bum fuzzle. <laughs> Pan. Pan. B U M 
nephew, ZZ Ali. <laughs> Hell yeah. She called I don't know how to use an assistant. What? This word is like a dead giveaway. You are bumfuzzled about this word. Bumfuzzled? So you just used an assistant. I did. I just gave it away. That means to be confused. Yeah. To okay. be confused. So Bumfuzzled, to be confused. Give me your last word. Last word is... It's an easy word. Let me find another one. Oh my, here we go. Eudaimonia. Eudaimonia? Eudaimonia. Eudaimonia. Um, U E D U E D A M O N I A. Yeah. How many it's letters are A lot. <laughs> oh, you know what? It's, it's probably a P. It's probably P E U D. Like pneumonia? Yes. No. What does it mean? This specific person suffers from eudaimonia. That's not wrong, but it's not wrong. What's the definition? But I don't know how somebody would suffer from it. It means happiness or well-being. Uh, you can't okay. suffer from happiness. Well, you still spelled it wrong, so you don't get any point. Now. How is this spelled? E U D E. Oh, I had the E U D E M O N I A. I had the. Why did I think of that? <clears throat> We are going to close out today's video here, but before we go, we have one shout out to give. Just one today. Just one. One. And the lucky shout out goes out to La Familia Romero. They are our 150th, 150th, 150th. Got us all befuzzled, bum fuzzled. Bum. Because they are our 150th subscriber. Hell yeah. That may not mean a lot to you guys, but it means a lot to us. So, I, I like to have this view on things that you are trying to accomplish. As Adri was saying, 150 might not seem like a huge accomplishment to you, but to us it is because we try and focus on that goal that's right in front of you. Ultimately, you might have a goal that's like years on down the road. Which we do. Which we do. But if you focus on the little goals. The, the 300 meter target and not the 50 meter target, you can miss all the small ones in between, which would help you reach the ultimate destination. And it so. just makes us that much more grateful right. for the little things. Absolutely. And we are always grateful Absolutely. for the little things. So meeting this small subscriber amount mm -hmm. just means so much more to us than you guys think. From starting from zero to 150, having 150 people just watch our videos whenever we post yeah. and comment and interact with us means so much more than you guys would ever know. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. Obviously. We do. <laughs> we have a dandy old time. And I know most of you are probably wondering, like, where's Aaliyah? Where's Aaliyah? Aaliyah well, is knocked out yeah, right now. It is so. currently 11 o'clock at night. Yep. And she has been asleep all day. Mm -hmm. Whoa. No. Whoa. She has been asleep for a while now. Because yeah. we had a long day of potty training. Yep. A long so. day for her. So she will be in our next <laughs> video. Don't worry. She will be back. We know you guys love her and she mm -hmm. makes the videos not us yeah she does thank you guys for watching make sure you guys like comment share subscribe to our channel and after you subscribe don't forget to turn on that notification bell so you can be notified every time we post a new video hell yes send us some challenges because we're down we'll see you guys in our next video you, you, you got to let it go you, you got to let it go